Good evening. Welcome to Pink Tie Gala 2023. It's hard for me to follow that video. <laughs> Keep it together. But I'm going to try. The last time we gathered here was March of 2020. And man, we barely got Tim Grimes across the country to Kansas City. The eagle landed and life as we knew it suddenly was no more. Um, it's a great honor to welcome each of you to this fifth annual Pink Tie Gala. We are grateful to bring back the light this year and once again gather in this beautiful theater to celebrate life, remember those that we have lost, and give hope and love and light to those who are fighting. I'm Amanda Griffith. I'm a breast cancer survivor and the chairperson of GLOW. GLOW stands for Giving Light to Our Warriors. GLOW has distributed nearly $25,000 to local cancer fighters since our nonprofit was formed. Pink Tie Gala was born after my own battle with breast cancer, hence the, the color pink and the name. But GLOW supports fighters of all types of cancer and all colors of ribbons. Thank you to Allegheny County and surrounding areas for your continued support. Not only do you support the gala, but you supported during COVID when we sent out letters and said we can't do anything, but would you mind contributing? You did that. We, we were able to get together last year and stay outdoors and do the golf <coughs> tournament, and you all uh, supported that, and we're very grateful for that. We're once again reminded that this little place called the Allegheny Highlands can do great things, and we thank you for that. Um, I'm going to call Scarlett over. All right, so at this time, we would like to currently have anyone who has ever had a loved one, a family member, or a family member or your, your, a friend who's dealt with cancer, stand up. If you, well, if you are newly diagnosed or fighting cancer right now, stand up. And I did that one backwards, so, <laughs> okay, so. So we don't have any fighters now. So as we saw a moment ago, if you or someone you know and your family or friends have been affected by cancer, stand back up. <laughs> <laughs> That's what my sign says. <laughs> All right. So look around. As you can see, cancer has affected each and every one of us. My mama was that last picture. This is why we're here to. This is why we did it. This is why we have the gala. This is why we. This is why we are. This is why we are passionate about this cause. You can only see. Thank you. At this time, I want to thank some extraordinary people, um, the GLOW volunteers, or we've called ourselves the Pink Tie Gals for years. Um, these girls devote countless hours to this organization. Pink Tie Gala is hard, time-consuming work. We butt heads with each other. We hug each other. We love each other. If anyone got a hold of the Facebook Messenger thread, they would... <laughs> have us all committed probably. <laughs> I mean, it's it's hard work, and um, they do it with, with such passion, such grace. They're quick to jump in and do anything, and I couldn't do it without them. Um, Scarlett Nicely, Michelle Shoemaker, Aaron Huffman, Sheila, Sheila Brantley, Christy Morgan, Tanya Wolf, Tara Brewster, Ashley Mor Morris, and Holly Mestemacher. 
These ladies each have actual paying jobs, and they all have families, and they each work countless hours of overtime for the Pink Tie Gala, and I thank you so very much. We have um, two unofficial members of Pink Tie Gala who, <laughs> um, Ashley Morris is one of our newest girls to help us out and her husband John did not know what he was getting himself into when, when Ashley signed up. So John has helped us with our website, he uh, put together the video that you saw, he's got all the slides going. We absolutely could not have done this without John this year. And we are so grateful for all that he has done for us. Thank you. And one of our pink tie gals, Christy Morgan, her daughter, um, Autumn, who, let me give a plug for Four Moons Designs and Clifton Court. <laughs> Um, Autumn has helped us. Autumn designed this pink tie logo many years ago. She designed our Glow logo and she comes to meetings and she, she designed what you all are going to pick up as you exit this evening and you will be able to take home a wooden pink tie gala Christmas ornament to put on your Christmas tree this year. So we're very thankful for Autumn. Okay, um, we want to thank Madison Washburn who took your picture as you came through the door. Um, I want to thank Jonah Carton who's going to be playing music down in the underground this evening. Um, <laughs> absolutely. We want to thank DJ Kimberly who's going to be up on the third floor West Rock room. Um, <laughs> Um, we want to thank the Historic Masonic Theater for the use of this beautiful facility. Thank you to Justin, thank you to Terry, thank you to Wendy and everybody on the crew that has come together. Um, we're, it's new management, it's new staff from the last time that we did this and, and it's, we're having growing pains and hiccups and we, we are absolutely thrilled to work with this team and um, you can imagine a dozen indecisive women. That's not the, the easiest task, but they have rocked it out and we appreciate that. Um, at this time, I want to thank our sponsors this evening. And we're going to start with our in-kind donations. Um, we have Cove Designs. We have the Flower Center, Bartley's Meat Market, Soundwave Entertainment, Four Moons Designs, the Historic Masonic Theater, Formals and Florals on Main, Image Express, uh, J.D. Vi, Chris Cahoon, Timmy Reynolds, and Bear Mountain Signs. And we thank you all very much. <laughs> Next, we have our blush sponsors, and those are Cootie's Pizzeria, West Rock, Jackson River Community Credit Union, David Holly and Taylor Staten, Walton's Tree Service, Slaughter and Slaughter Family Dentistry, uh, the Association of Western Pulp and Paper Workers Union, Lucas, Barnwood Blessings, Cecil and Stephanie Andrews, Safe Homes, and Clifton Forge Moose. Our raspberry sponsors. We have Chatlin's Plumbing, Heating, and Air, Southern Steel Salon, Covington Moose Lodge, Pampered Pets, Aunt Scarlet's Pet and Sip, Connections Plus Healthcare and Hospice, Taylor's Hometown Automotive, and Hilltop Detailing. <laughs> At our pink level, we have Casito Healthcare, Allegheny Highlands Community Services Board, and Career Support Systems. At the VIP level, we have Highlands Community Bank and T Tech. OK. 
Okay, at this time, um, we want to present our program sponsors for this evening um, with a gift. Our first program sponsor is Alcova Mortgage and accepting, Jason could not be with us tonight, so Eric Schultz is going to accept on behalf of Jason Helmenthaler. Alcoa Mortgage has generously sponsored Pink Tie Gala for all seven years that we have been doing this, and we greatly appreciate it. Our next sponsor is Ingevity at the program level. And Ingevity has been a proud supporter of Pink Tie Gala and Glow for several years as well. Um, and when we received word this year that they wanted to be a program sponsor, we were absolutely delighted. So if we can have our individuals from Ingevity to come up. choked up on this one <laughs> and you will understand why. So our final program sponsor is Carilion Rockbridge Community Hospital and they're fabulous. They have sponsored us at the top level since this thing started. This is the choked up part. <laughs> Seven years ago I was battling breast cancer. I had gone through my chemo and I was getting ready to have bilateral mastectomy. And I tried, you know, I had my down moments, don't get me wrong, but I, was, I tried to keep upbeat and I tried to face all this head on. So I got all my friends together. We rented what was then belly up, I think. And we had a bye-bye boobies party. And we just partied down a week before my mastectomy. Well, as we were coming in, Mr. Greg Madsen was there eating dinner that evening, and he approached me that evening when he figured out what was going on, and he came to me, and he said, I'm rooting for you. He said, I work for Carillion, and he said, here's my business card, and he said, anywhere along your path that you need help, you reach out to me, and that, to me, that meant more than any donation that he could, that he could ever give, because that was so personal and so caring, and we want Greg Madsen to come up and, <laughs> and be presented with this gift, and we appreciate all you do. Once again, I would like for you all to give a big hand to all of our sponsors. 